that's a hair bet you could take, I guess. Um, let's jump out of the rift for game number one. Yeah. As now we do get an engage here. Quantum does not have flash, and that's a lot of sticks in the cow. That's going to be first blood given over to aiming. And the Fate's Call just used for dramatic effect. They didn't even need it. As long as he doesn't take the stun from Cuz, oh, but he is going to be hit by that, as now we do have Lucid coming on in, and this is immediately a 3v2, and they're both on fire as Dudu and Cuz are going to bite the dust. And Kellen and Lucid just get there before anyone else. Yeah, and look at this, Kellen's coming down already, but that is the Drake gone. They want to take a follow-up fight here. Teleport is coming in from the side of Dudu. As Quantum, that is a big equalizer right on top of that teleport as well, as everybody on the side of Quang Quangdong is pretty low, as immediately the first kill will go to the side of Quangdong Freaks, but you see Bull is going to go down, and Aiming is just throwing a bunch of spears into everybody, as Cuz, being kited out here, might be able to take down Kellen, but I feel like eventually the rest of DK will come in here and help him out, although trying to utilize the brush, and Showmaker can't get close either. He knows what's going to happen. And so they got to just wait for King in and aiming to make their way over. Cuz still potential to get out here, and in fact, they will let him go. And meanwhile, Kellen just hiding in the banana brush. Quantum does not have Flash. He does not have his Unbreakable Will anymore. And he is no longer with us on the Rift for now. And eventually, King in will just die. Yes, it's cool. Meanwhile, oh, God. Uh, a lot of huge things happening in favor of DK oh, immediately no. afterwards, no, no. although they are pretty deep. Aiming is going to try to go down to the Varus, which he will. Not able to make it out as a wall. Trying to bully King in here. I'm not sure if that's going to work out. We have a lot of ults thrown into the Rumble, though, and Kellen is unfortunately not able to help him out enough. And a couple of picks going the way of Kwangdong Freaks, trying to claw their way back in this game. The thing is, is it's not really a flip, but also it's very dangerous to be stuck in the pit uh, against what they're going up against. Dudu is uh, just dead, as Lucid is also here. Dudu is Aatrox, and he's going to get the ult out of Lucid at the last moment, I suppose. But Tragic. Still going to go down, just do that, and then if they get a little bit too close, you just turn. Uh, this is one way to do it, I guess. Uh, they're going very deep in this, no and it's only Kellen and Aiming. As now, Bull trying to get some damage down. Kellen in a bunch of trouble, and there's no more Fate's Call, so he's just going to go down. Um, yeah, pretty interesting. And we have seen teams struggle in that exact part of the map here, and so will DK. Now DK kind of up against the ropes, and they're going to respect it. Actually, the Equalizer is fantastic, but a massive ult comes in from Bulldog and hits everybody. As now Aiming is going to be taken out, and DK oh! are going to be wiped off the rift. Um, oh, man, Quantum coming in over the top. That is a massive pulverize and a big chance for Quantum Freeze, but a lot of low health bars here in Showmaker, and Aiming still alive because he's getting some resets. The miracle it's happening as Bull and Cuz in the pit. We're going to try to take Showmaker. this in the two-man as Showmaker is alone, but he can't do it alone. And Kellen is going to be taken out as a last thought as well, just dancing in the brush. And that is an ace to the side of Kwangdong Freaks. Beautiful. The trap? Uh, Cuz in a little bit of trouble, but now it's actually Bulldog who is going to eat a bunch of damage himself. Elusive getting pretty low himself as he is so incredibly low, but it is Cuz. That is going to be the first one to go down. And no! now it's Bulldog who goes next. As a 4v3 in favor of DK, and the Kalista is going to pop off in moments like this. King is a bit low, but Quantum gets the double engage. Dudu ulted away, but you can't keep him out of this fight forever. As here comes Shoei. He's going to jump over the top, takes out Dudu, and might be able to do it. He's up against Bull, and it's Bull to take him down. And here we go, Bull up against two. And there's no objectives on the map. There's nothing to fight for. Uh, Something. Wait! No, Bulldog! Fuck. What's going on no. in there? Bulldog's down! And now Bull is eating a ton of damage from King, and who should be traded back. Not like this! 4v4. No guarantee. This is a very strong Diego as well. And a chance, and a flash, but it doesn't matter. He's dead anyway. And now Dudu. Over the wall he goes, he's going to be taken out by the Crux. And now we have Showmaker in a lot of trouble. Hey, it's Aiming, who goes into his GA, but the power of the Varus and the Viego in this situation are too strong. And Quanto Freaks will win the fight and maybe the game. I think that's it. Bulldog's alive as well. DK. <laughs> they don't.
don't even get cuz! Kingen's alive! Oh wait, he can ult wave. There's no there's no there Baron. Is Baron. Oh, no, still a Baron. Yeah, I think that's it. I think this should be it, but Kingen, one last stand. Oh, he doesn't have Zhonya's. Doesn't have Ignite either. Uh, I think it uh, he can't do it. That's gotta be it! Do it, yeah. And he's just gonna get ulted on, and that'll be the end of the rumble. End the game, as here is Bulldog as well. Shows up for the end. And uh, we fell off a 6,500 gold two and two together and give us a third game in this series. Let's hop into the rip for game two. Arts to rely on. Oh my uh, god! Okay. <laughs> what? He's gonna get it. First blood. Just like that. Trade your flashes too. Handshake here is gonna put an end to this aggression. Ooh. But man, King and he's out for blood. <laughs> Arrows on top of it is quite nice. Oh my god. He's assaulting on top, and dude is in a lot of trouble. Just gonna eat the lightning. Go in! Die, and now he is dead, and there's nothing he could do. Kingen is uh, letting them know about this champ or Fate's Call. As now, Big Flank is coming in, though. They're trying to get behind onto this backline, but Bull is totally safe, and Kellen's gone immediately. Quantum gonna knock him, Showmaker, and the follow up stunts are huge. As we talked about from the draft, Quantum Freaks, they put two and two together. I think Blue Sid! Oh no! Blue Sid, he's caught! And eventually, you felt like this was gonna happen, right? Blue Sid had his hands, head in his hands, but there's just no vision, there's no control. They don't know that Baron is happening or not, and they're gonna try to turn onto him, but now Bull is on the run, has to flash away. Blue Sid is so far away from his team, but he's got King in there. King and leaving the charge, but the rest of the team can't do any damage. As in the back what? line, he's trying to take out Bull, and King is left to die all alone! Now that Nico not gonna hit anything, Handshake is good to delay them. As a scatter comes in, Bulldog has been so clean on those, and now Kellen's gonna be taken out. It's a 5v3, Quantum Freaks. Potential to take this one and go to playoffs if they beat TK tonight. They will they do that. Lucid's gone! Lucid's gone, and Quantum Freaks, they want more. They'll take aiming as well. As he will just turn to his inevitable doom. No flash, no way to live. And it's only Showmaker, as five men from the side of Quantum Freaks are barreling down the bottom lane. Quantum Freaks pull it together when it matters most. There's just no time. I mean, take a look at the. the yeah, it's just over. It's done. The Baron buff will help them push in, and Quantum Freaks, they are going to playoffs of their own hands. They win a 2-0 against D plus Kia. We did not expect it. Please reveal the standings.